Jersey has released in theaters and it is Shahid Kapoor who is hitting the ball out of the park this time. Straight out of his Kabir Singh look, Shahid returns to the big screen with Jersey almost three years after his last film released. And you don't feel he has changed one bit, at least as far as his get-up is concerned. However, stark opposite to his aggressive Kabir Singh, his Arjun Talwar in Jersey is far more calm and restrained. Playing a talented but failed cricketer, a doting father and a husband trying hard to save his marriage from falling apart, Shahid carries the film on his able shoulders. While he hits it out of the park each time he's on the field, the film shines in patches and with a disrupted narrative often loses pace. A Hindi remake of the 2019 Telugu film by the same name, Jersey has been written and directed by Gautam Tindanuri, who also helped the original. And no prize for guessing, the remake is a scene-by-scene -scene copy of the original, much like most of other South Indian films that get remade in Bollywood. Jersey Trace is the tale of an exceptionally talented Ranji player Arjun Talwar, played by Shahid Kapoor, who quits cricket at the age of 26 and after 10 years decides to revive his career and return to the game. In the process, Arjun wants to fulfill his son Kittu's, played by Ronit Kamra, desire for a jersey and dream of seeing his father play cricket. Along this journey, Arjun goes through emotional turmoils and confrontations with his wife Vidya Talwar, played by Mrunal Thakur, who bears all the financial burden of the family. But despite all helplessness, nothing seems to stop Arjun from following his dream of playing for the Indian national cricket team. He finds support in his coach Madhav Sharma, played by Pankaj Kapoor, who also acts as a father figure to him. High on emotion, Jersey lacks on the intrigue value that would keep you hooked. And the nearly three-hour runtime of the film makes it only worse. To begin with, Arjun and Vidya's romance and their struggle to convince her South Indian father to marry her daughter into a Punjabi household gets a bit too stretched. Even as the director tries to infuse a slight humour in these scenes using typical tropes of dichotomy between North and South India, the jokes fall flat. In the entire first half, we only get to hear two things over and over again. Son wanting a jersey and the father struggling to arrange 500 rupees to buy that. It is only in the second half that the story starts moving forward. Also, the film's only big reveal that comes during the climax did not really overwhelm me. I wish the makers had thought of a different twist to make the story stand out from the original. More than sports, Jersey highlights the dynamics of relationships between a father and a son, a husband and a wife, a player and a coach, a failed cricketer and his friends. And that, I felt, lent a beautiful depth to the film. The endearing performances while displaying these bonds that actually take the cake. Shahid does not go overboard with his performance and stays understated. His expressions of anger, frustration, helplessness, happiness and victory strike the right chord. I felt the Punjabi touch spread rather unevenly in his dialogues could have been avoided. Nevertheless, this would definitely be counted among his finest performances. The film gives ample scope to Mrunal to perform and she lets her expressions and eyes do most of the talking. Mrunal's chemistry with Shahid isn't superlative but just works to an extent that they don't look odd together on screen. Ranit Kamra as Shahid and Mrunal's on-screen son is the same kid from the original film and is as good in the Hindi remake as well. His scenes with Shahid are just delightful and you can connect with the bond this father-son duo share on screen. And then there is Pankaj Kapoor, veteran in the truest sense and a character that you instantly fall in love with. Even in the handful scenes he has in the film, he picks up little nuances and brings the much-needed comic relief as well. The scenes on the cricket field have been beautifully shot and cinematographer Anil Mehta captures the game in a magnificent way. The enthusiasm and curiosity you feel while watching a cricket match comes alive in these scenes. To sum up, Jersey stays true to the sports drama genre it belongs to and without digressing much, it strikes a fine balance between the game and emotional side of a sports person. 
only if the makers had worked a little harder on the editing table and brought it to two hours something, it would have been an ideal crisp watch. This is me signing off for now. See you soon. Till then, stay safe.